Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. So with that said, let's get right into the beach forecast today. It will be a decent beach day. We've got waves two to three feet. Uh, there is a moderate threat for rip currents out there. Uh, we've had that moderate threat for a while. It will probably continue into the weekend. You can still go to the beach. You just have to be extra cautious. And this isn't just for Virginia Beach. It goes all the way down to the Outer Banks, uh, all the way down to Hatteras. It's a moderate threat. So again, you know, if you get stuck in one of these, you swim parallel to the shore and then back in up or down the beach away from that current that's trying to push you out. Just try and stay as calm as you can and always swim near a lifeguard. So having said that, you know, we had a cool month. Uh, there were some beach days, but I mean, a lot of these days were below average. We ended up four point. Well, we'll probably end up about four point one degrees below average. We still have to get through today, which is going to be uh, below average. But uh, for rainfall, we ended up about two point six seven inches above average. We had a wet couple of weeks in there for sure. Now our temperatures today will be in the mid 80s. We're not going to hit 90 and we still haven't hit 90 yet this year, but the heat is on for Memphis, New Orleans, even Atlanta. I think they're going to have some heat, but some storms may cool them down at three o'clock. Uh, but going into tomorrow, we're going to be in the upper 80s. Might even hit 90. It'll get close, but upper 80s what I'm calling for. And then we got uh, temperatures near 100 in Atlanta, Memphis, New Orleans, Dallas. It's hot. It's going to be hot down that way. Uh, but we might hit those 90s on Sunday. If we don't on Saturday, we're more likely to get it on Sunday, and that could be the first time we hit 90 this year. So the heat index, let's put that in there. Today, 86, heat index 89. Not that bad. Tomorrow, the temperature 89, the heat index 93. So if you're out and about, you want to stay hydrated. But boy, Sunday, that's where it could be rough. 92 for the forecast, what I'm calling for, 98 for that heat index. And air quality, well, it's pretty bad up towards D.C. and Richmond. Around here, it's unhealthy for some groups. And so if you're out and about, uh, if you've got uh, asthma, emphysema, COPD, you know, you may want to stay indoors and close those windows and use those A.C. filters to try and clean out that uh, smoke and haze. It's a little bit. It's not bad, but still unhealthy groups. We got an easterly wind today. Maybe that'll help us out a little bit. High pressure to the north. And there's no rain right now. Maybe a sprinkle going for the Outer Banks, but that might just be some extra thick clouds. So today we're going to be partly cloudy between now and noon. Looks good into the afternoon. A few showers, isolated showers popping up, most of them towards I-95, but a couple may get into Hampton Roads during the afternoon and early evening. Overnight, a couple of stray showers, maybe even tomorrow morning, a couple of isolated showers. Look at there's a little bit out there and then in the afternoon, a few showers. So tomorrow I got the chance to rain 30%. It's not huge, but there will be a little bit of rain out there Saturday and then we may get a big cluster Sunday morning and then that goes away. Now the timing might change on that. Stay tuned. Maybe it gets more into the afternoon. We'll see. The models are going back and forth. So 86 today in Killable Hills in Virginia Beach, 86 in Norfolk and Portsmouth, 88 in Chesapeake. Some haze, isolated afternoon shower possible. 83 in Melfa, 84 in Hampton, 86 Newport News, 89 in Williamsburg. And the only thing we have going on in the tropics is one little weak disturbance that has a low chance of formation near Bermuda and uh, probably won't have any impact on us. Just well up the waves a little bit. 89 tomorrow, few showers, uh, some scattered showers and few storms Sunday, 92, and then Tuesday, not looking too bad. Hopefully the rain's just in the morning.